I'm Charlie. Um, like Sydney, I have a uh, family from New Zealand. Um, most children, when they're young, have a strong attachment to toys, pacifiers, favorite cup, favorite blanket. Um, but for me, it was always a jade necklace that I received um, on my first trip to New Zealand when I was eight years old. Um, I didn't take it off when I showered, didn't take it off when I slept. It was always in sight and around my neck. Um, but what I didn't know when I received it was the rich cultural history of jade and the significance that it has to the Maori tribe who are native to New Zealand. Um, and jade is not only practical in its everyday use to the Maori tribe, but it is also seen as a treasure. But what makes it a treasure? Um, jade is often passed down as a family heirloom, so many times um, they're, they're, they're considered priceless. Um, and they're very prestigious, though, because they're often passed down from centuries of generations um, that have now all the way come to present day. Um, and it's also seen as a symbol of individual prestige. Um, as in the 18th and 19th century, um, warriors would be decorated with jade, and the warriors who were the most decorated um, were considered to be the best and strongest fighters or to have won the, the most battles. They would also wear jade as a sign of good luck, as it was seen um, to be a good luck charm. But not only was jade seen as a treasure, but it was also seen as a practical tool in everyday life. Um, because of its strength and toughness as a stone, jade was often used in household tools, such as axes, cooking utensils, as well as gardening tools for cultivation. It was also used in tools for fishing and hunting, so they made it into fish hooks, arrow, and spearheads, um, and they would also use those spearheads um, in battle. So jade was not only worth a lot to the Maori people, but it was also extremely practical. Um, as you can see, the cultural significance of jade to the Maori tribe of New Zealand is immense, and it represents so much of Maori culture. And something that I find impressive about it is that like Maori culture, it is really tough and very resilient, but it also is very beautiful. Whether it's through its use in the household, the fields, or hunting, there's a lot of significance to jade as a historical treasure to the Maori culture. So next time you see a piece of jade jewelry or a tool built using jade, you know a little bit more about where it came from and what it means. Charlie, how did you get so, what is it that you'd like to